Hey everyone, it's Jenny, and I'm going to do an unbagging of a couple of necklaces that I purchased from Soul Coo. I don't know if that's exactly how you say it or not, but I'm assuming so. But um, I found them online. Um, it's just one of the kind of Facebook ads that I'd came upon. Also, I'd seen a few um, girls around work and stuff wearing the necklaces, so. I didn't know where they got them from or anything, I just noticed them and then I noticed them online and realized that's where they had purchased them from. Um, Soul Coo was founded by a group of women, uh, stay at home moms. Um, so they uh, came up with this idea to create these necklaces using like just gemstones and everything. They're affordable necklaces inspired by the healing properties of gemstones and the spiritual laws of attraction, belief, and intention. Um, says Soul Ku, meaning the word Ku in Japanese translates to a place of infinite possibility. We like to think of our company as just that, a place where guided by our soul's calling, anything is possible. Um, so it's just a group of women who started it, um, just stay at home moms. Um, they wanted to connect themselves with the other women in their lives on a deeper level, um, and then just help touch people's lives and everything. Uh, they handcraft all the pieces in their own homes and their own time frame and everything like that. So I think it's pretty interesting. Um, plus, I've kind of gotten into gemstones and stuff lately. I've always kind of liked them, but I've really gotten into them lately. So I decided to order a couple pieces from their website, just as kind of like a Mother's Day present um, to myself and everything. Uh, so let's get started. On the back here is my shipping label, so I won't show you that, but I'll open up this and show you what I purchased from them. Alright, so I have my invoice. Everything. I purchased two necklaces. I had a few of them saved in my cart, um, but I just hadn't, you know, I just decided on two for now, and then I might purchase more and add to the collection later. They're really affordable and everything. They're really cute. Um, so let's get started here. This is their card. Um, so I can share the photos on their website. It says there. And it says you have a chance to win a free necklace. And... This is a little bit, you can pause that right now if you want to and read the card. But it says here, your purchase helps support nonprofits that celebrate, inspire, empower, and connect women. So that is pretty cool. So the two necklaces I purchased are the Garnelian gemstone necklace. Um, it's for abundance, which I purchased it to help, like, inspire, like, motivate. Um, you know, I work with resin and stuff like that. I like to create stuff. I like to craft. So just motivation and everything is the main reason why I purchased this necklace. Um, it says... When you set an intention and take action, the entire universe will conspire to make it happen. And then you register your intention at soulku.com. So, and it says down here, it even has their little signature on it, infused with love, song, and prayer, handcrafted by moms in Asheville, North Carolina. So that is really cool. I really like the orange and everything. Um... The cord is kind of like a light tannish brown. It is a super strong nylon cord. Well, it says it right there on the package. Um, the findings on it, like the little 
findings and jump rings and stuff like that are all sterling silver so I really liked that about this company because I just I don't like wearing stuff that's not sterling silver because it will kind of turn you know my finger green if it's a ring you know I just I like to wear sterling silver jewelry and this is really simple and pretty and then you have the sterling silver findings on the back and um, the chain I believe goes um, 16 to 18 inches so you can layer these they even have another three inch extension that you can buy and add to this necklace if you wanted to they have all kinds of different gemstones all different meanings and stuff like that um, I had a few others saved to my cart so as soon as I can I will probably get those later on um, but for right now I got this one and another one um, we'll go ahead and take this one out I really like it it's really really simple and pretty It is just a really thin nylon cord. Um, looks like they have it pretty good on there on the findings and everything. The chain is very delicate in the back, so I wouldn't, you know, it sh probably shouldn't be yanked on or anything like that. Definitely not yanked on. But with it being a 16 inch chain, you can wear it kind of around like a choker almost. So if you're wearing, you know, if you're wearing, if you have kids, it might be a little bit better on you to wear it shorter like that. Maybe they won't pull on it so bad. Um, but this is the necklace. It's orange. It's like a darker orange, a lighter orange. Then if you look at the stones, there's some white in there too. So it's really pretty. might put it on the back of this card here and let the light hit it a little bit but it is really pretty I like that one a lot um, the next one I got is this one it is a Norina Norina Jasper it's like a red colored Jasper you can't really see it that good um, in this light but it is a dark red color. Actually, you might be getting kind of what it looks like on there because it is a dark red color. I was hoping I'd get more of a little bit of the white in the stone, but this one here barely has any white in it. Um, this one says it's made by, looks like it might say Allie, I'm not sure. Um, supports grounding and the release of negative energies. I tend to have anxiety and stuff like that so this kind of caught my eye and was in my cart because I felt like oh, okay you know maybe wearing this will help me you know release the negative energy <laughs> that's giving me the all the anxiety and stuff so I'm going to take this off up here and I have noticed that it looks like the stones kind of glued to this card so that's kind of sucky in a way <laughs> yeah it's like glued to the card but I got it off I did get it off um, but you can't still can't really see the stone let me see if I can't. You can kind of see some of the white in the stone. I need to get something really white and put it up against it. So maybe you can see. Maybe my light will adjust. Maybe it will adjust itself. 
and it doesn't look like it's working but it's a really dark red so yeah it's it's really pretty it's still really pretty stone and everything um, I was hoping for a little bit more white in the stone but um, they're kind of random and everything so it does show you varieties of the stone you might receive so but it does you can kind of see the white in it you can't really on the camera though let me see if I can maybe zoom in Oh, there we go. You can kind of see that red color there a little bit. Maybe. There we go. You can see it now. But that is that one. Now that I'm up closer, I'll show you this one too. So that's that one. It's really pretty. So I guess you can tell I kind of went with some orange and red colors. Just kind of is how it worked out. Um, I was looking at a couple more on there. Like I said, um, there was a quartz crystal that was on there just for harmony that would look good. It was like a um, crystal shape hard to explain but um, it looked really pretty so I was interested in it too but like I said I have stuff saved in my cart you know so I will slowly start to build my collection they are affordable but you know I mean when you have other bills to pay and you know kids staying at home because there's no school right now it is a little bit of a tough time so you can only do so much but I really like these. I cannot wait to wear these necklaces. I'm probably going to wear this one around the house, you know, on my days off maybe. And then this one at work just to kind of, you know, help with any kind of negative energy. Or, you you know, I could layer them if I wanted to. It wouldn't look too bad, you know, layered. There's some orange and then there's some red. You know, I don't know. They're both really cute. But they have all kinds of different colors of gemstones. Like, I plan on getting some more and doing um, another unboxing video and everything. So, I hope you enjoyed this video. Go check them out. I will link the website down below. I really like these. They look really good on, trust me. Like, um, they have pictures and stuff on their website. And... They're so pretty. And plus, I've seen girls at work wearing them. They're really pretty necklaces. And this cord looks really thin and stuff, but on their website and everything, they say that it is really super strong. Um, the only thing I would worry about is kind of it fraying a little bit, but I haven't really, you know, noticed that on the people at work that wear them. They haven't really said anything either about them, but... They're really pretty. I can't wait to wear them. Hope you enjoyed this unbagging video of Soul Koo necklaces.